past the shoe section it's the entertainment section i can't even remember last time i went to a walmart for movie hunting because they downsize so much but who are the new releases i haven't even been keeping up with the new releases to be honest infinity pool yeah i think this came out it's a decent film decent little film it's just it's okay if you like possessor yeah but i wasn't the biggest fan of possessor we stocked up on whale the worst slip cover of the year anything here Rick and Morty, yeah, these whoa, whoa. These are cool. Warner Brothers 100 DVD covers. That's cool. And obviously underneath that, see exact same stuff. That's cool. From Dark Knight trilogy. Nice. The Looney Tunes. Can't forget Looney Tunes. Complete Platinum Edit collection. 150 shorts. That's not bad. It's only like that, but for thirty-five dollars for a DVD. Nice. I like the gold sheen to these. Yeah, I copy for House of Dragons season one for forty bucks, four K. It's actually not bad for the amount of content that's on there for forty bucks. You got Frozen Planet too. This is a four K. I haven't really read much about, but you can't really go wrong with these. Probably eight K Masters. That's cool. Thirty-four dollars a bit steep though. And you got your generic. Blu-rays, your Walmart Blu-rays. I actually heard decent things about Missing. I heard it was actually decent. I heard Searching was better, but... Fetch. Yeah, this was a Slayer. Slayer's Blu-ray disc. It's okay. Let me check this side. There's nothing here. More of these Disney gray boxes. Nothing cool in the actual section. They made an R.I.P.D. 2? That's funny. I like how the, the DVD has a slip cover, but not the Blu-ray. Why? Okay. Ambulance. I need to get that on 4K. Never seen it in the wild on 4K. Actually, I think I saw it day one when it came out, but I'm like, yeah. But I have a crush on Jake Gyllenhaal, so I need it. <laughs> but yeah, it seems like nothing. They have one 4K. Oh, they have two. But nothing. Again, nothing special. All right, we're here at another Walmart. My favorite Walmart used to be. I think we have... We've experienced the day. I think uh, I think it's it's time to pour out one because they don't even have the new release section anymore. There's a little excuse me. Do you guys still have movies? So the, oh okay. Oh they move electron oh, okay. Okay. We're safe. They just moved it somewhere else, hopefully. Yeah, but this used to be an entire movie section. Now it's just, I guess it, it comes with the times, you know, physical media, even though it's not dying. It's just, I don't know, people don't really care about this stuff anymore. Uh, at least when it comes to the general public. But maybe now that they have an actual designated section, maybe there'll be more stuff? No, it's still video games. It's still video games. So they we got this new release section here. That is DVDs. They got these white boxed or gray boxed Disney stuff, which I really don't care for. Anything cool here? You got, of course, multiple copies of Thor Love and Thunder because no one liked that movie. Yeah, I like that movie. It was okay. But you got the Fable Men's on Blu ray, but why would you get it on Blu ray? You get the 4K. You know, Blu ray looks pretty good too. Christmas, Bloody Christmas. I heard some decent things about this. This is a nice looking slip cover. Embossed, shiny. That's cool. There's some cool DVDs if you still collect DVDs. What is this, MVD? No, yeah, Mill Creek. Mill Creek DVDs. That's cool. But there's no, what is this? Easter Bunny Massacre. More Mill Creek. Hudson Hawk. What the hell is that? That's funny. Mark Hamill. What movie is this? Control Alt Defeat. Executive producer Roger Corman. What in the world is this movie? This movie looks insane. But yeah, there, there's no, there's no 4Ks. There's no Blu-rays. Well, there's Blu-rays obviously, but there used to be back in the heyday. They got this box at $100. 
It's a Big Bang Theory DVD box for 135. This is Futurama. <sighs> Seems like the only thing that's still alive are the Disney Blu-rays. Lightyear, Pocahontas. Oh, but it does come Pocahontas too. That's cool. You got Tarzan, one of my favorite uh, Disney movies. Is there a 4K of this? I don't think so. I think it's 4K on the uh, Disney Plus. But... So it seems like, yeah, the only real kind of distribution here is Disney, which is insane to believe. I know a lot of people are like, oh, Disney's killing their physical media. But here in Canada, it seems like they're the only ones that are keeping it alive, especially in the mainstream. So yeah, new releases. Sad states. I forgot to show this section before. New releases, the Magic Mike. Yeah. Mel Gibson, that's funny. Yeah, Banshees of Sharon. See, I'm tempted to pick this up because I love the movie, but it's Dolby Vision 4K on Disney Plus, and I already paid for Disney Plus. If there's a 4K, I would have been interested in picking it up, but it's just a Blu-ray. Eh. Even though you do get the bonus features, which I do love, me some bonus features, but another Mill Creek blue DVD. But yeah, that uh, that's all. There you go. Look at this. I remember seeing this when it came out. Tinch Feiger. And we had a uh, Michael Kine. So yeah, that was Walmart slowly getting rid of their physical media until it just completely phases out. Sad day. At least you still got the five dollar bin. So yeah, as you saw, literally nothing there. Where is the new releases? This is why I've, I haven't really been doing any Blu-ray Tuesday hunting because there hasn't really been anything coming out. When they do come out, for some reason we don't get it here in Canada, at least in the my areas where uh, I usually shop for new release items. But yeah, that was today's Blu-ray hunting. I do have Serpico coming in the mail. That probably won't be here for another couple days. But besides that, nothing really much. I'm still waiting for my Kino Lorber sale uh, stuff to come in. Some of my Arrow pre-orders that I'm really excited to get in. But besides that, that was today's Blu-ray Tuesday hunting. Sorry it was a bit uneventful, but that's the life of uh, a collector you know sometimes you win sometimes you lose you know sometimes there's some really good exciting stuff that comes out and sometimes it's a slow week today was kind of a slow week i know there's a lot of really cool stuff that are only released in canada i know 12 angry men came out also in canada today or in the u.s today but we never got that so anyways that was today's blu-ray tuesday hunting thank you for coming along with me on this hunt if you enjoyed the video please make sure to leave a like and subscribe because it will incentivize me to do more content like this and it's free man i mean and it means a whole lot to me anyways please have yourself a good day night evening afternoon morning whenever you're watching this please stay safe and god bless peace cheers long physical media see you guys